Yo, beast mode, I go beast mode. Left, right, hook, then I reload. Speed until the E breathe slow. Connect to re up a cut, clean blow. Ben Horner for Southport Jab, Hula Louie Lin. Um, well, what can we say? It's another win. Um, did the fight go how you wanted it to go? Learning fight. Uh, not necessarily I wanted to knock him out, to be honest. Like, obviously, I wanted to take my time, and if it came, it came, but that's what I wanted to do, and I feel like it's a good learning fight because he's a tough, um, like, tough opponent, Jalen or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Losses, but he just tucks up well, and uh, like Kevin said, he, he's going to look for one shot, and he did catch me with a good shot in the first, which I felt it. And, uh, but then, yeah, I recovered, and I called him, rocked him a few times, and then they stopped it because of the cup. Fifth, I think, Fifth, I yeah, yeah. It. Yeah, so, um, there's big talk of Louis Lin. Uh, yeah, yeah, people good. are like talking about you in the boxing world, um, even good, outside, yeah. you know, the casual fan, if you like, oh, yeah, they right. sort of spoke about it. How do you deal with that pressure, you know, like to, to perform, to put on this show? Yeah, like, to be honest, I get, I get nervous before every fight, that like, I was nervous for this one, and even before every sparring, because I always want to do my best. And uh, thanks to God, yeah, I feel blessed, and that's why I'm doing what I was born to do, I think. But it's just, yeah, just learning. And I feel like, yeah, like, God's got my back, so no matter what, if I'm going to get a bit nervous or whatever, the bigger the occasion, it's always going to be pressure. It's just staying relaxed and dealing with it. Obviously, it's something that a lot of people have probably asked you, but having Kevin Mitchell in your corner yeah. and such experience, yeah. how does that help you, you know, when you're, you're going back to the corner every, at the end of every round with his advice coming across to you? Ah, that's all right. No, no, <laughs> no, it's good, really good, yeah, because obviously he knows his stuff, he's been in there. And that's like with all the training, he knows like exactly how hard to push you, what to get you to do, like strengthen your legs up. And thanks to him, he got me doing a lot of leg work, like heavy squats and, and a lot. So that's why I take, luckily I affirmed that shot. And uh, yeah, because obviously you can still get cool anyway, but it does help. And I've been having like hard, hard sparring and I've like, been, like a few shots, but obviously you stay on that firm and carried on. So yeah, just getting better and better learning every day. Man. Looking forward, um, when when can we expect to see you back out? Or is it a case uh, of now yeah, just ne going Yeah, next on? month, as it goes, yeah. Back 27th on. of October, it's a matchroom show. And um, yeah, it's so a John Ryder, Craig Richards, Ted Gee, yeah, yeah. uh, uh, Copper Box. Yeah, Copper yeah, Box, yeah. yeah. Awesome, brilliant. Well, yeah. thanks for your time, Thank you and I'll speak to you again soon. Cheers. Cheers.